Hey guys, and welcome back to the Parting Adventures of Cool Cats. Cause Cool Cats are one man party. Oh yeah. Right, so before we continue, <coughs> this is a dangerous area, and I kind of want to be wearing armor and the beret rather than the Bright Brotherhood robes, which I'm going to just ditch, and the party hat, which I'm going to keep. Oh yeah, ready for action. I'm also not going to be using that rebar club as much as it would amuse me to do so. Yeah, I might need some heavy firepower down here. Doctor, if you want to use a scope, I can spot for you. Keep you on target. Did I mention Boone's spotting perk? Yeah, you'll see it work. Basically, when I zoom in uh, with my weapon, he highlights people, people for me, which is kind of cool. A little useless, but no more useless than Eddie's perk, so uh, it's all cool. <coughs> so it is entirely possible to sneak through this entire area. It is a bit tricky, however, because there are invisible super mutants crawling all over here. Which is not fantastic. I think I know where I have to be. Yeah, I think this is where I want to be. Yep. Excellent. One won't. <coughs> this is quite a dangerous place, so I might die horribly. We'll see how it goes. And that is one valuable nail board. Like, over a hundred caps for a board with some nails in it. Hmm. Who would have thunk it? Anyway, I'm kind of, I feel my hand twitching towards the quick save key there. Uh, old habits, I suppose. Click. <laughs> this guy up here, I like this guy. Come and get it, you big dumb. Hey, you're not one of those things out there. Who the hell are you? And I bet he <laughs> told you it's the creator's will for you to risk your ass instead of him, right? Well, good luck with that. I give you a hand, <laughs> but no thanks. I may look like a corpse, but I'm partial to living. First off, I'm not trapped. This was a tactical choice, all right? Super tactical. I'm no match for those things out there. So I found a good defensive position, and I've been defending it, right? <laughs> oh, who am I fooling? I'm trapped. Name's Harlan. Pleased to meet you. Harlan's cool. What happened was, I was the first time I played this. Work when those things I'll let him talk, cause he's Most pretty of cool. The fight was upstairs, but some folks panicked and made for the basement, and I went after him. Well. Turns out there were even more of those bastards down here than upstairs. And things went to shit fast. I couldn't find the others. So I fell back to this room. Set up a nice little kill zone. End of story. Guess the outfit gives them <laughs> away, huh? I never did buy into that religious mumbo jumbo with the robes and all that shit. It gets lonely up in the wastes, okay? And I don't have to tell you. That Bryce group has That's got cool. some fine looking ghoulettes in it. Cool can dig it. Uh, or maybe I would have to tell you. <laughs> anyway, I helped them out. And they kept me supplied with ammo and pleasant company. Oh wait, what? what why would I want to kill this guy? He's awesome. <clears throat> so the first time I played this game, I got to this guy and I thought to myself, I want this guy to be a companion. There's actually a few characters in this game that I met them and I was like, why are you not a companion? You are awesome! He's one of them. So uh, if you're out there and you're listening and you've got a uh, dab hand for the modding, this guy needs to be a companion. He's badass. Let's talk about how he survives. I'm not delicate. Rad roach meat for protein. Condensation off the pipes for water. And I do my business over in the far corner. I wouldn't say it's <laughs> comfy. Huh. Well, you're polite. I'll give you that. <laughs> if this was just between you and me, I'd do as you ask. 
But it's not. I had a friend with me when those mutant bastards came out of nowhere. She panicked and ran the wrong direction. Further into the basement. She's probably dead. But I ain't leaving until I know for sure. I'd have gone looking myself. Except I wouldn't last a minute out there. You, on the other hand, seem pretty resourceful. So, <clears throat> I've got a couple of options here. Uh... There's the peaceful way, and there's the not peaceful way. I not, I'm honestly not sure which is the easier way, which will result in me not dying. Um, but I can at least showcase the idea behind the easy way. Yeah, that I can do. I will pop in here. Oh hey, who is this guy? What's that, Adler? We have a sister. <laughs> An assassin more like. Oh. Say kill it, Adler. Or safe sick. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay, Adler, I'll ask. Uh hi, human. Why you come here? Remember how I mentioned who that Adler? stealth boys make Adler. Night King go crazy? What do I tell it? Yes, yes, of course. Who Antler is not important to you. Antler wants that. Yeah, this guy's crazy. Me. <laughs> Cut it out, human. Serious. Final warning. Uh, let's ask him who he is. Me, I am devoted to Antler. <laughs> but before Antler, Captain once. Last name Davison, first name. Don't remember. I commanded a troop of Nikon, the yeah. master's elite. A great honor. Basically, all the super mutants used to be people. It's kind of sad. I wandered the desert, life without masters. <laughs> hard. The others' minds going strange, going crazy. But then I found us new master. Oh, hell, Antler! Since then. Everything's been going really well. <laughs> A human who is friend to ghouls? Suspicious. Do meet the ones upstairs. Antler used intercom. Told them stay put. But they want to come down in basement anyways. I cannot allow. My kid are <laughs> not right in head like I am. They attack you on sight. Ghouls too. They yeah, so a little bit of perspective here. He's the sane one in his little uh, gang. Brought us to get. Good. Antler brought us here for a reason. Why was that Antler? <laughs> right. A, a piece of paper. Shipment invoice. Hundreds of stealth boys sent here a, a long time ago. But stealth boys must be in the one room. One we don't search yet. The one we can't search. Yes, says awesome. So yeah, um, <coughs> I don't know how this is going to end for any of us, um, but I'm going to try and get these guys out here peacefully, and I think I owe it to these guys. I mean, it's not their fault, they're all completely nutters. Um, that's of course the uh, technical term. Um, so I'll see what happens. Unfortunately, I am fairly kind of sort of sure that Harlan here will try and kill you if he catches you sneaking up there. So <sighs> let's get naked. You may wonder why I'm stripping down to my skivvies. That is because uh, the agility penalty on the heavy armor will basically cause problems for me. I'm also going to leave these guys here. I'll sit tight. This is a dangerous situation for me, by the way. Going on on my own. Uh, yeah, this could be the end. Hopefully not, though. Did you find my friend? I'm not. 
So I'm going to sneak up and see if I can't find evidence of the stealth bunnies, one way or the other, up here. Uh, as you can see, there are traps everywhere because Harlan did a very good job of trapping the crap at this place. Really hoping he doesn't shoot me because that would suck because I really like Harlan, as has been covered, and I don't want him to die. I also don't want me to die in case he decides to train that uh, rather nasty hunting rifle of his on me. Probably shouldn't have turned that on. Gotta be careful up here because there's also landmines everywhere. Oh snap. No. Ah. Uh, he went hostile. I had no choice. Ooh, lunch. Yoink. Sorry, Arlen. I liked you, but uh, I couldn't take the chance. I feel sad now. I didn't want to kill that guy. Oh well. Yeah, so if you go through the rest of the place, chances were I would encounter some Nightkin and once you kill the Nightkin, Davidson doesn't isn't friendly with you anymore. So I'm gonna go through all these quickly because this is the information we want. Basically it says that the Nightkin uh, the stealth boys rather were sent here by accident, they messed around with them, and the stealth boys were sent back. This is why they think they're here. So there you go. And that's all the evidence we need. So I kind of want to go back and do that bit again. Because, you know, as I say, I, I would rather keep Harlan ra alive than the Nankin. Because I really care about the Nankin. Unfortunately, I'm not going to. Because I said, when this all began, I would live with my actions. I would accept the consequences. That was scary. I would accept the consequences of whatever whatever action I chose. So I am. Sorry Harlan, you were a cool guy, but unfortunately cool cow's cooler. Or, or something. Anyway. So yeah, we've got a nice couple of boxes of ammo from Harlan. Ooh, that, that was serendipitous. Alright, so we still need to get this room alive. I'm going to quickly go down and disarm all of these things. That was a bomb. I'm, I'm just going to get out of this room alive. I'm not going to worry too much right now. Do I have any more Hydra? Yes I do. Do I want to use Hydra or do I want to use a doctor's bag? How's the rest of my body looking? That'll tell me. Yeah, go on. Yeah, so I just want to get this room alive. Uh, I'm going to quickly sneak over here and rifle through Harlan's pockets. for his shinies. And that's enough for now. Pop. Right, so I know this way is safe because I came in this way. I'm gonna run across here and head down here and get the hell out. Hey Boone! Okay. I had to kill a guy who's cool. Uh, it wouldn't be too much to ask for a hug. No. No. Oh. What if Davison will give me a hug? Victory! By the way, check out that sword of his. It's called a bumper sword. You get the I reference. Have boys. Have you found them? Liar! The invoice said stealth boys here. Um. Antler read it out loud to me. Um. 
please, please, please don't attack me. What invoice note said stealth boys were here? Why can't that note be true? <laughs> but human could be lying. He's stealing the stealth boys for itself. Oh, Antler, you trust so easy. I'm not cool. I uh, believe you. Nikon will follow the new note to find stealth boys. Better be there. <laughs> so uh, he takes Antler and walks away. Uh, job done. We save the Nikon and the ghouls. What what what's left of them both really? <clears throat> I hope they all lead long, fulfilling lives. Yeah. So what is going on back here? Oh, I remember this room. Oh, hello. Cop. 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 Uh, I was kind of hoping one of these would be a Star Vault camp. It's beginning to not look like it though, unfortunately. I'm just going to hit this button. Because it does this. I feel like there should be more servos there. You really can't be a good servo noise. Anyway, now that Davison's left, I am the new Lord of Antler. I mean, uh... Yes. I am. I'm doing shifty eyes. You can't see the shifty eyes, but I'm doing shifty eyes. Anyway, uh... That's enough for today. Until next time, guys. I'll catch you later. See ya.